So we went to the mountain in Switzerland. Oh man, such a view. The slope was quite steep. Like it was even like hard sometimes for us, but the robot could go over all of these obstacles and we didn't need to help the robot. Like until now, like when the robot used perception, mostly they were just assuming that the map is always correct. So if there's a step in front, the robot like trust the map and steps on it. But often when we go outdoors, this doesn't like uh, happen. Like when you go into the tall grass and those obstacles appear as steppable object for the robot. Like if the robot always trust it, it cannot like go into those areas. It's trained end to end, so the network gets both information and tries to estimate kind of a ground truth information. If you combine with the body information, you can recognize that the map here is wrong. Then you only trust its body information. So with this controller, the robot can go to like a area that is dangerous for the human or like a very far, like for example, in the nuclear power plant or disaster area, like on the other planet surfaces. Like, and I think this can open up possibilities for those applications. <laughs> Woo! <laughs>